you guys keep an eye on the bobber. Look at this little guy. Hey, buddy. Oh, no! What is going on, you guys? Welcome to the very first Mountain Trout Catch and Cook Speed Challenge. We are currently in the tent. The moment I go out that door, the, the clock counts. No edits allowed in this. I only have one more GoPro battery left for a chesty outside. This one's about to die. Let me explain the rules. I'm only allowed to fish either with natural baits that I find or the bullet lure. That means power bait not allowed. We're gonna leave that right here. We also need to forage at least one wild mushroom and some wild berries, and we need to get it all done in one GoPro battery. That gives us maybe about an hour. So let's go. Time. Oh. Man, okay, no edits, no shooting intros a million times. Oh, come on. Time starts now. One GoPro down. Oh, come on, baby. Ah, what am I doing? What am I, I just don't want mice going into the tent. Oh, come on, come on, come on, come on. Whew, time starts, time starts. All right, you guys are on a chesty right now. Here's the straps. I'm gonna throw that on my chest. And uh, welcome to camp. Here's a trout net, but first let's go ahead and get a mushroom. I wanna say, I found some mushrooms out here the other day. There's tons of mushrooms growing everywhere. Here's some mushrooms right there. We got some ingredients right up there in a bear proof bag that we're gonna need to come and get later when we catch a trout. Oh, oh what's this mushroom? <sighs> no, no, that's not good to eat. Oh, come on, baby. Oh, let's see here. Oh, here's another mushroom. Uh, not sure if that's good to eat either. We need to be sure. No, that's not good either. Oh, come on. All right, we're in a time crunch. Let me get uh, my foraging knife out already. Oh, what's this? Oh, that's a... Uh, oh, man, let me know in the comments what this thing here is again. It's not a uh, cauliflower mushroom. It's the other one. It's the other one. Ah, not good to eat, though. Come on. Baby. Ooh, what do we got here? Nope. Don't want to eat that either. Uh, oh, oh, let's see, let's see. Oh, let's go. All right, let's take a look. I'm pretty sure I know what this is. This looks like a uh, 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 porcupine mushroom. No, it's the, what's that though? Hedge, hedgehog mushroom. There we go, let's go hedgehog mushroom. All right, mission number one accomplished. Let's just clean this little guy off real good. Harvest the whole thing. We're gonna need that for the catch and cook. Oh, come on, pine needle. Get out of there. Oh, you know what, let's take this guy too. We took the big one, medium one, and there's an itty bitty baby, but we'll leave the baby to grow. Oh, you know what, here's another one. Look at this, medium one. We left one baby, we're, we're gonna take this guy. Wild mushrooms are so delicious. I cannot get enough of those. Tell you what, we have a little container here to throw these guys into. Whenever you guys cut mushrooms, always make sure to clean them before you put them in your container. Otherwise, all the dirt just mushes all over them. There we go, wild mushrooms. Let's go, baby. Let's go ahead. Ooh, pretty. What's this one? Oh, very firm mushroom. I did not expect that. Look at that. <laughs> All right, we're running out of time. No time to mess around. Wipe that knife off on your leg. Doesn't matter. No rules in the woods. All right. Wild mushrooms. All right, we got to run. All right. Tent secure. Oh, here we go. Barry's right by the tent. There we go. Mm. Just kidding. Those don't count. That was just a little snack. We got to find more berries than that. We got the tent or the net. Uh, all right, we got to get down. We got our fishing poles down by the lake here. And let me see. We are, time-wise, we are three minutes in. Three and a half minutes. Okay. Here's the fishing poles. We have two poles. One of them is already set up here for us with the bullet lure. Can't go wrong with that in the mountains. Now this guy here is set up with a slip float. What we're gonna have to do with this is find some natural bait, which we can find under the rocks here at this lake. So let's go ahead and start fishing our way around the lake with the bullet lure. And uh, 
Then once we find some bait, then we can upgrade to fishing the slip float with uh, live bait. All right, come on. Oh, hooked myself. Okay, let's go ahead and take a cast here. Watch it just happen right away. That would be wild. Uh, this lake has, so far I've found in this lake, uh, rainbow trout, and then something that looked like maybe a golden trout or something. I could not tell what it was. Oh, did we? Oh, there's a follow, follow, big one, big one, big one. Big one followed the bullet lure. Man, that could be a fast speed challenge if, uh, oh, if that, bit, that was a good trout, like this big, looked like a big rainbow. Hungry rainbow. They've been, uh, they've, they, yeah, this lake is the land of the giants. Oh, come on, baby. Come on. Come on. Oh, let's give it a couple more casts in this spot, see if that big one comes back. Usually you'll get like one or two falls out of them, and then they're gone. Oh, come on. I like to do a nice fast retrieve up here in the mountains. These are not lazy, like stalker trout. These guys are, uh, yeah, they're growing wild up here. And they are hungry, hungry big trout. All right, last cast before we move. Oh man, that was such a tease. That was a big trout that followed, guys. Like a 17 incher probably. Whew, come on. Time to start looking out for uh, some spots where we could maybe find uh, some dragonflies. That's what we're gonna use as live bait. All right, nothing on the bullet lure so far. And we move, you know, here, let's just take a quick peek. There's a piece of bark right here. Usually under bark is where I'll find these things. No, nothing. What about under this rock? Nope. Just make sure whatever we pick up that we always set it right back where it was. No dragonfly. Oh, come on. <laughs> Itty bitty tiny one. We don't want that. Got to be a little bigger. Oh, there's a good one. Look at that. Look at that guy right there. Jackpot. Jackpot. Let's see if there's another one we can find. You know what? No, one, one is good. Let's not get greedy. Let's go ahead. Oh man, I don't really have a place to put this dude. Tell you what, let's, um, let's get over here. Let's start moving. We're going to work our way around this lake. <laughs> Look at our bait. Right here, we've got uh, our cooking station as well as thumbnail spot all set up already. And what we'll do is, here, don't run away, little guy. We're gonna set you, oh, he's running away. Never mind, he's running away. We're gonna put, have a little bait jar here. Let's set the wild mushrooms into the pan already. Cover them up so no mice get them. And we'll put the little dragonfly larva right in there. All right, put them in our pocket. Man, usually we would have another angle running. Oh, there was a trout that just surfaced right in front of me. But uh, we only have this one camera, so chesty it is. Whew, let's go. It is getting dark as well. So sun is probably going to set in about 30 minutes. So let's do this. Hopefully we can do this all before it gets completely dark. Uh, Let's go ahead and just make a couple casts right here at the bullet lure. Oh, a big trout just jumped over there. Come on, baby. Oh, oh, come on, come on. Oh, one almost hit it. Little guy. Little guy almost hit, that would have been food already. That would have been food. Man, that would be a fast one if we would already get one right there. Let's try that again. You know what we might do is get the bobber ready. This is a good spot. It's nice and deep right here. Uh, haven't caught a trout here before, but look at that steep bank. Oh, another one surfaced right over there. Yeah, let's do that. That's, that's wise. We've got two poles. Uh, in order to make this work, we might need to fish with both of them. So let's get the bobber ready to roll. Here we go. Here we go. We're using itty bitty little tiny, it's called like a mosquito hook. And uh, let me show you how I put that dragonfly larva on there. If you guys already watched the channel, 
then you know how I fish these dragonfly larvae. But uh, if you've never seen it before, this is one of the best mountain baits out there. Look at this little guy. He's all ready to go back in the water and we'll let him. Oh no, you dropped him again. Come on, baby. Come on. Basically what this is is a dragonfly nymph, the larva. They uh, lay their eggs, adult dragonflies mate and lay their eggs in the water. And uh, then when the eggs hatch, they turn into these little guys. And then when they grow up, they come out of the water and then they hatch out of this little body and become a dragonfly again. All right, let's go ahead and cast the bobber right there. That looks like a good spot. Now we are fishing with both the bobber. We're going to set the bobber pole right here. And then we'll fish the bullet lure at the same time. There we go. Now the dragonfly larva, this is the best. I mean, it really, it is the best bait that I've ever come across in the mountains. So don't be surprised if that bobber goes down really fast. I would be surprised if we got one on the bullet lure first, but you know what? So far we've gotten two follows on the bullet lure. The fish are hot right now, extremely hot. So hopefully, hopefully we can change that. That'd be so oh geez, I cast it into the bushes behind me. What did I just do? Oh no. Oh, we have to save the bullet lure. We aren't allowed any reties. If I break off on anything, it's gone. Oh, look at all the berries. Look at the berries. Oh, we got our bullet lure. Bobber is right down there. Tell you what, while the bobber's fishing, let's get these berries knocked off of our list. Wow, I didn't think we were going to stumble into this many berries right here. Tell you what, we'll get on the other side of the berries. That way, if the bobber goes down, we'll see it. You guys keep an eye on the bobber. Seriously, that's your job. Keep an eye on the bobber. I'll get uh, these berries picked here. Oh man. Oh, this is the jackpot on the berries, dude. Look at all of these. Now these guys here are wild uh, blueberries. They're called huckleberries. They grow up here in the mountains and they're absolutely delicious. Here we gotta get a whole handful. Oh, come on, I just wanna see that bobber go down. Let's go. That would be a really fast speed challenge. Now, I've never done one of these before. Let me know uh, if, what you guys think, if you want to see more of them. Oh, that bobber has me sweating, guys. It has me sweating. All right, a couple more berries, and I'd say we have the berry challenge taken care of. Ooh, here's some other good ones. All right, look at that handful of berries. Here we go, proof that we're eating them. Mm. Oh, so sweet and delicious. Something bitter in there. Maybe there's a little bug inside, not worried about it. Mm. Oh wow, invigorating. Those berries are so good. Let's cast from way up here. There we go, super far cast. How sick would that be to get a bite <laughs> from up on the cliff? Slow retrieve. Come on, baby. Come on. Come on. Where are you guys? If we don't catch anything here in another minute, we're going to have to move again. Oh, oh. Oh, this is so weird. If anything weird happens, I can't edit it out. That's the rule. I have to do it all in one take. Let's check time here too. We're at 13 minutes. Camera is at 81%. Uh, let's try to, okay, one more minute here. One more minute. Let's see what happens. And then we gotta move. I wanna try, if we can't catch anything here, we're gonna try and catch them from the other shore. I've been seeing some big ones, really big ones surface back there all the time. Nothing. Ooh, that's a good cast. That was a really good cast. All 
All right, we're moving. Moving on. Oh, stepped on my pole. That's smart. All right, we're gonna gently reel this guy in. If we reel it in too fast, we'll break off the, the dragonfly and then we have to find a new one. So let's keep trying to fish this guy. I'll show you a little trick on how to keep him, keep him contained. So he's on the hook. And we're just gonna put the hook through that little, little tiny thing there, tighten the line and we got the dragonfly on the pole ready to roll. lure oh man tell you what i'm gonna this is steep i don't want to fall in the water oh oh almost fell almost fell in the water come on baby here we go here we go here we go ah oh, do we fish right here do we give this a shot right here? I think so. Let's go ahead and just try this spot really quick. Only like a couple casts or so. Let's get the dragonfly out there. I just heard a fish splash somewhere. Not sure where. Dragonfly is out. Bullet lure. Let's see if maybe we can lure something in with the bullet lure and then catch it on the dragonfly. where all the big ones are is way out there. Come on, someone's gotta smack that bullet lure. What if we fish from right here? Could happen at any time. This is what if I get skunked, guys? What if nothing happens? I doubt that. I doubt that. I've got a really good feeling here. All right, I think we're gonna move on. I don't think there's any fish sitting right here. Nice and gentle. Easy does it. Easy does it. Ooh. All right. Sorry, little buddy, you're on the ride for your life here. All right, let's keep going. Man down. Oh, wet log. All right, we're good. We're good. I think we're good. <laughs> All right, got a little excited there. A little excited. That log got me. Uh, it rained here, so everything's a little slippery, but it's been drying up. Didn't expect that. Let's make sure our rods are okay. Oh, we lost our dragonfly. Dang it. Ah, oh, what a bummer. All right, let's keep going. A little more careful. A little more careful. Getting super excited here with this, the time challenge though. I saw like red berry juice on my hand. I'm like, whoa, am I bleeding? <laughs> All right. Now I'm all by myself out here in the mountains, 
I forgot to mention that actually in the video I hiked up here two days ago. So I've been spending the last three days in the mountains and uh, just fishing for food and having a blast. But that being said, there's no one else out here, no reception. So if something happens, I gotta get myself out of there. So we do have to be really careful. Let's see here. This looks like a really good spot, but we need a new dragonfly larva. I can't believe that we ate crap like that. Nope. Oh, there we go. There's a good one. Really good one. They just sit under, see that little guy? They just sit under pieces of bark, under rocks, pieces of wood, sticks. I feel really good about putting a fresh one on too. Oh, he's trying to get away, trying to get away. Oh, geez, there he goes. Come on, baby. Let's get you on a hook. Put him on a hook and fish him. All right, tell you what, one little bobber cast from here. We'll let it sit for maybe We'll do four casts with the bullet lure. How about that? Bobber right there. All right, let's go. Right by that big rock out there, that's where a lot of them have been sitting the last few days. So I feel really good about being at this spot here. Oh man, I see steam coming off of me. I'm so, I'm so freaking hot right now and sweating. Oh no. There we go. hyper focus mode right now <laughs> time's starting to count the trout are proving to me the two earlier that followed the bullet lure they were just there to tease us they were just there to let us know hey this challenge isn't going to be easy to make us think it is but now we're going to get towards the breakdown stage where we're mentally starting to break down thinking it's never going to happen and we're like why did those two in the beginning what, what are we doing wrong why did they come over and check it out why aren't they anymore all right, last cast with the bullet lure and then we're moving on. All right, cast right past the bobber and then lure him in with the bullet lure. You know what, we're gonna try one slow retrieve. One slow one, just in case. Just in case that's what they like. Nope, nothing. and easy with the bobber. Come here, little buddy. <laughs> oh, man, I noticed some of my split shot is sliding too. Oh no, that sucks. I don't want it that close to the dragonfly. Oh, I just thought I saw a trout swim right there. It was just a branch that was like wiggling under the, the little waves, the ripple in the surface. All right, so we will continue on now over past here in the lake on this side here. This is where I've got really high hopes that we're gonna do good. Just gotta cross all these boulders here without eating it again <laughs> drop a like if you liked seeing me totally uh fall on my face there earlier 
Um, oh, look at all those little bugs in the water. Well, oh, there's a bird out there. Look at that. Ooh, here's a good spot. Here's a good spot. This rock here, that'll let us cast far out into the middle of the lake. That's worth staying for at least five or six bullet lure casts and the dragonfly larva. All right, hardcore parkour. Oh, come on. There we go. All right, first things first. Let's get the dragonfly out there so I can start fishing by itself. I just slammed him across the rocks. I'm sorry, buddy. <laughs> Ooh, that's a good spot. Really juicy out there. That was a juicy, juicy cast. There we go. All right, come on. I really want to get one on the bullet lure, though. That'd be sick. You guys keep an eye on the bobber right there while I fish the bullet lure, right? I guess I don't have to watch the lure. What am I talking about? Keep an eye on the bobber anyways. There we go. Oh man, I don't know where we're at with time, but I know that it's getting tight because we still have to cook this fish. Oh man, we got to catch one fast. Gotta be one in between here. Nothing, huh? What about if we just go out there between those two rocks? <laughs> oh yeah, right there, right in the honey hole. Let's go ahead and jig one in. Man, it's so quiet up here. Like, not even the birds are really making noise right now. All I'm hearing is a few flies flying around. Uh, it rained all of last night. It was super, super wet. Oh, did you guys just see the trout jump out there? That's so within our casting distance, too. Next cast is going right on top of them. All right, come on, come on, come on. It's behind a big boulder there. Let's hope he swam in that direction. If we do get him, we're going to have to YOLO him over the boulder. <laughs> ah, nope. Nothing. All right, guys, you know what? One more cast here, and then we're going to move on again. We're going to keep moving down the shoreline. We might have to run all the way around this lake. There you go, last cast. This one, you know what? Let's do a, let's do a slow... Kind of jig. Oh, bobber down, bobber down, bobber down, bobber down, bobber down, bobber down. Did you guys just see that? Oh, we're going to lose the bullet lure now. Oh, come on, bobber, go down again. They might have pulled the dragonfly off. Please, please, please come back. Oh, man, I'm not sure what just happened there. All I saw was that bobber just go down. Did you see that too? Let's see if we can save our bullet lure. Oh yeah, we got him, we got him. Oh, I'm not sure what happened. Should we check the dragonfly or not? We have to check it probably if, uh... ah, what a bummer. Oh, come on. If nothing happens here during this cast, then we're checking it. Usually a trout always comes back uh, if they spit it out the first time. Man, what a tease, what a tease. We had a bobber down. Oh, I thought for sure we were gonna get one right there. They rarely let go of the dragonfly. All right, let's see if they actually ate it. Let's see if they ate it. Here, tell you what, just a little jiggle. No, it feels like it's still on there. Let's let it drop one more time. Sometimes they like it when it drops. Oh, 
surprised that trout is already, he's already moved on. They don't really sit around in the same spot for too long most of the time. They're usually moving. It feels like we still have the dragonfly. Yeah, no, he's still there. He's still there. Let's see if he's alive. Sorry, buddy. Did you just get nommed on? He's like, yeah, I did. Please don't put me back in there. Sorry, bud. This is not your day, but at least you're on YouTube. <sighs> let's see. Yeah, you know, let's go ahead and keep moving. That, that try, I'm not sure, guys. We could keep fishing here, but I'm just going to say we keep moving just because that trout might have commitment issues and might not want to he might not want to play today. So we're going to keep on going. Going around, around the pond. All right, we're now halfway around the lake. See, the water's so clear, we can kind of almost sight fish for them here. How about, yeah, how about we, yeah, no, let's go just a little further, a little further. I saw some monsters here before, so yeah, right here. Let's try this spot here. Let's send that dragonfly way out there. Was that a fish that just surfaced right there? Oh, what was that? What was that? There might be a fish. What what just happened there? Let's just get this dragonfly out there. There we go. Dragonfly larva deployed. Bullet lure. Some, something just happened there. There might have been a fish that just surfaced. I'm not sure. Oh, bobber down, bobber down, bobber down, bobber down. Bobber down, he's draining, he's draining. Oh, oh. Munch it, munch it, munch it, munch it. Come on, munch it. Oh, no! Oh, and we lost the dragonfly. We lost the dragonfly. Did you guys see those bobber downs? That might have been a really small one playing with it. Dang it, now we need to find a new dragonfly. Oh, there's a fish right there. There's a fish right there eating. Oh, come on. Come on. I'm not sure where we are on the battery, guys, in time. I don't have time to look. Oh, there's all these other bugs, but I want the dragonfly larva. Oh, come on. Don't tell me I can't find one now. No. Come on. Come on. Oh, the bullet lure's sitting out there. Hopefully it's not tangled. Oh man, that thing was immediately going down. Immediate bobber down. Let's see here. This area looks good. Come on, gotta be a dragonfly here somewhere. Tell me I can't find any more darn dragonfly larva. What about on the other side of this tree here? Is that one? Yes, it is. Oh, oh we dropped him, we dropped him. There we go, dragonfly larva. On the hook he goes. All right. He's on, he is on. You know what, since we're right here, we're just gonna cast out. Oh, almost got stuck in the trees behind me there. There we go. Oh, there's already a trout right there. There's already a trout playing with it. Oh, there we go, fish on, baby. Wow, oh, aggressively went for it, aggressively. Oh, that was a bobber down so fast. Immediately he saw that dragonfly hit the water. Come on, let's get to the net. We gotta get to the net. Oh, slammed it. Absolutely slammed it, guys. Oh, we're stuck in the tree. No, 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 no. 
There we go. We got it. Oh, no. Oh, oh no. He came off. He came off. Oh. Oh, no. Oh, that's such a shame. Right there. Right there. What happened? Oh, we still have our hook. He just, ah, oh, he popped. Oh, what a bummer. Okay, well, let's get the net over here this time. We're gonna try and find another larva right away. Where are we at on time? Oh man, we're 50% battery. We're halfway through. I'm in trouble, I'm in trouble. Can I make this happen? Oh, oh, oh I fell again. Oh, that trout was on fire. That trout was absolutely nuts. I mean, he hit it and immediately started peeling drag. You like how we just abandoned the poor bullet lure over there? Poor things like, Daddy, come back. Oh, nothing. Come on, little dragonflies, where are you? Oh, there's an adult dragonfly. Oh, there's a salamander down here. Look at this little guy. Hey, buddy, let's let him go again. <laughs> I'm sure he'd make great bait, but that's not what we're after. I thought we had one there. Come on, come on, come on. There's gotta be more dragonfly larva. Oh, come on. The trout are hot right now, they're hot. All right, we gotta keep moving. I can't find any dragonflies here. Itty bitty one. Do we fish a tiny dragonfly larva? Tell you what, let's, oh man. This thing is so small. But let's go ahead and put it on a hook, throw it out there while we try and find a bigger one. We'll just fish it. There we go, itty bitty, tiny dragonfly larva. All right. Oh, I think that tangled up. That tangled, I didn't like that. Yeah. Oh no. What? Why? Come on. Not now, I can't afford this at all. I don't have the time for tangles. Oh, there we go, there we go. Oh, you know why I tangled? My split shot is bunching together. We gotta spread it out just a little. There we go. Perfect cast. I'm gonna leave that right there while we try to find another dragonfly larva. Whew, that bobber could go down anytime though. So we gotta be prepared here. There's a, another kind of small one, maybe slightly bigger. Hard to tell. Oh, 
man, they've never been as hard to find as this. This is ridiculous. What if we put two on the hook, maybe? That could work. Oh, dude. This is impossible to find them right now. An itty bitty one, we don't need that. Oh, we lost him. Ah, oh, we've lost that other little one. Dang it. All right, come on, one big one. One big dragonfly larva. Ah, kind of a small, small medium one. Ooh, nice piece of bark. Let's see here. What? Nothing under the bark? Oh, unbelievable. This, this is a whole nother challenge, dragonfly larva hunting. Ooh, there's a good one. That's a good one. Any more under here? Oh, there's a giant trout, giant trout, giant trout. He's giant, he's giant, he's like this big. We're gonna try and get away. Oh, he's cruising this way, he's cruising this way. He's cruising this way. Let's get that bobber right in front of him. Come on, baby. Come on. Right in his path. Oh, there he is, there he is. Oh, he's a big trout, a big trout. Dragonfly is gone. Okay, all right, staying low. I can still see the trout. We're gonna stalk this guy. We're gonna put the big dragonfly on. Come on, baby. Oh, come on. Get on the hook, come on. There you go, where did that trout go? That was a monster trout. Oh, there he is, oh, there he is, I see him out there. He's swimming this way. There we go. And, oh, he's looking at the bobber, looking at the bobber, going for the dragonfly. Come on, take the dragonfly. Oh, he looked at the bobber. Why did he look at the bobber? Don't look at the bobber, that was a monster trout. He's still there, he's still there. He's right there. Come on, baby. Turn around, turn around, turn around, come on. Turn around. He's swimming that way. Oh, we missed that one. Let me set the bobber stop really shallow. It's not very deep here. And we're gonna try actually, since we're casting short, we are gonna shift that split shot way up. Sorry, I'm talking to myself here, guys, walking myself through this whole scenario. We need to try and get this dragonfly presented to this fish as naturally as possible. I'm just trying to get up high here where I can see that fish again. That was an absolute monster big tank of a trout. Oh, I left the net behind too. So we are down a bullet lure rod. We are down a net. And I, we're down a fish too. I don't see the fish anymore. Dang it. I lost the fish. Ah, dang, it probably swam out deep. Let's see if we can find it again over here. What I'll probably just do is cast this dragonfly out there and let him soak. spot magic moment oh I thought I 
saw a fish, but <laughs> just another branch again. Man. Come on, trout, where are you at? There is a huge trout there. Oh, he was a giant. Right, let's set down that rod. Time check. 34% oh, left on the battery. We are in trouble, guys. We are in big, big trouble. Oh, come on. Where is that trout? You know, let's start working our way back to the bull lure rod. We might need to start fishing that again if we have any hope of making this. Oh, GoPro's trying to do some weird settings here. What is this? I've been going for 45 minutes. Oh, come on. Oh man, come on, come on, come on. Cast it, slightly different spot. Man, we still have to go all the way back around the lake. Bobber's in a good spot. Let's go get the bullet lure and uh, we'll cast a little bit. Oh, right, we still need to save it, it's out there. When I leave, that's when uh, the bobber's gonna go down. I already know it. Oh, let's see if we can save it. I don't wanna lose a bullet lure. Oh, there we go, we got him. We got him. All right, two rods back in business. We are running so low on time. How am I gonna catch a fish and cook it in like 15 minutes? Because <laughs> that's about what we need to do at this point. We're at the point of pulling the Hail Mary. Whew, come on, baby, come on, come on, come on, come on. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. I'm so focused, so serious right now. <laughs> oh, come on, we cannot fail this. We got, oh, we got a bite. We had a bite. Oh, we just had a bite. What just happened? Was that a stick or, no, that was a bite. There's no stick there. Oh, we're so close, so close to making this happen.
Oh man, come on. All right, tell you what, we're gonna have to, like we have to time-wise start going back. So let's sight fish that dragonfly uh, on the way back. If we see any trout, this is our last chance that we have in order to do this all in time is uh, we're just gonna try and throw it right in front of a trout that we see. Make sure there's not one right in front of us. Nope. It's getting dark too. And I still have to hike back down and get out of the mountains before it gets completely dark. It's right, I have a headlamp, but still I don't want to hike in the dark. Every once in a while I'm just kind of peeking behind us to see if there's any fish swimming around. Nothing out there. Tell you what, we're gonna go back to that spot where we got one bobber down already. Or you know what, why not right here? Does this look like a good spot? Yeah, why don't we give this a try? Just one try. There we go, bobbers in the water. Let's try a really slow retrieve on this one. Maybe that's the magic. Maybe it's the magic. Kind of doubt it. They like a fast retrieve, but weirder things have happened. <sighs> Battery check. Oh man, oh man, it is. We are running on borrowed time, guys. Running on borrowed time, 20% battery left. We are in trouble. Nothing. 
All right, we got time to fish one more spot and that's it. One last spot and that's all we got. it this is the spot last spot of the day come on We're also running out of daylight. Man, it looks like I'm gonna be hiking back down in the dark. <laughs> that is gonna be a fun one, huh? <sighs> Come on. This is how it goes, guys. I mean, this is you know, unedited. Oh, bobber down, 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 right as I sit. Oh, oh, there we go, that's a fish. Fish on, baby. Unedited, that's how it goes. Hours of fishing, of nothing, and then all of a sudden it happens. Please, 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 come here. Come here, come here, come here. Oh, oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Feisty one, feisty. Come here, come here, come here. Oh, in the net, let's go. All right, we have no time. We have no time. All we can do real quick is put this guy out of his misery really fast. Oh, do I have a knife? I do have a knife. All right, here, really quick. First thing we're gonna do, and then we need to go cook him right away. Oh, come on, come on, come on, come on. Come on, come here, come here. We have no more time, buddy. Oh, I'm so sorry. Oh, jeez. Oh, he's still so active. We pulled him in so fast. We pulled him in so, oh my goodness, what is this? Oh, jeez. Oh, back in the net with you, back in the net. All right, come on. Oh. There we go, there we go, there we go. And he's out. He's out, out cold, no longer suffering. All right, is that hook out or is it still inside his belly? What happened? Oh, he, uh, he, oh no, there's the hook, there's the hook. Can we save it? Yes. Here we go, come on, there we go. Got the hook back. Fish in the net. Let's go, we gotta cook this guy really fast. We have no time, no time at all. I'm full of fish slime. Oh, the bull are still out there. My goodness, oh, he's right there, good. There we go. All right, let's go, we got a trout. We got a trout, but we haven't cooked him yet. This is a catch and cook speed challenge. Ooh. All right, now I gotta make sure I don't eat it again. How much batter do we have? 12%, tell you what, I'm gonna, I'm just gonna stop the GoPro right here. All I'm doing is running over there and I'll start her again so we have enough battery for the cook. Our cooking bag, it's up in the tree. All we gotta do is cook one little piece of fish. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Come on, come on, come on. Oh, come on off. Get off of there. All right, let's go. That's all we needed. Just need some butter. Butter and salt. All right. Sweating bullets, guys. Sweating bullets. On our wild mushrooms. Wild mushrooms. Here we go. 
bunch of dirt in the pan. Where's the butter? Here's the butter. In she goes. My pants are slipping. We just gotta cut down this mushroom just a tad. There you go, he's a little too big. Oh, almost tipped everything everywhere. Mushrooms are doing good. No time to gut them, we're just gonna take out a nice piece of meat here. How about this, we're gonna cook some tail meat. There we go. Come on. Ooh, red meat. Very nice. Oh, I promise he's dead. That's just some reflexes. I promise he is done. In the fish goes. Where are we at on time? 5% on the battery, it's gonna die any second. I'm already gonna say it guys. Like, comment, subscribe. There we go. First time NWFS speed challenge. Come on, come on, we just gotta stuff it in our face. But we can't eat trout raw. That was speed cooked. Oh, no Danish sea salt, but no time for that. All right, guys, love you. Thank you for enjoying. Oh, it's so hot. Try it right there. Oh. Dude, it's like so fresh, it tastes alive. Oh, I burnt myself. Oh. We did it. We did it with just a couple minutes. Seconds probably to spare. Let's just see when the battery guys. Mm. Man, did I have time for salt? Lemon after the fact. Oh, we forgot onion too. Mm. And you know what? There's no Danish sea salt in here. No, I take it back. Here it is. Here it is. Come on, baby. Come on, come on, come on. Just a little, just a little pinch. Here we go, pinch of Danny sea salt. Love you guys, we'll see y'all for the next fishing adventure. Till then, you all know it, fish on baby. Oh. Oh. Ooh. Oh. oh, there we go. Oh, we did it, <laughs> speed challenge. Oh, there's a big fish that just jumped right there. <laughs>